We are currently having a flatbread off. Molly thinks she can make a better flatbread than me. So we're heading to Shaw's. We're gonna see what she gets, what I get. Switching up breads, toppings, everything. But she really thinks that she can beat me in a flatbread off, so we'll see what happens. Welcome back. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We're making pizzas today. We're making flatbreads. Flatbread off. She thinks she can make a better flatbread than me. I, I think I can make a better flatbread than her. So we're going to put it to the test. Got a couple different things lined up. And we will see. We got some judges. We got two judges. No, and <laughs> we will see who has the better flatbread. Definitely not Molly. Mad Valentine's Day stuff. So I'm thinking a grilled peach, arugula, burrata, basil. Probably gonna toss the arugula with a little bit of lemon, olive oil. Oh, I, we need olive oil. Her dad. And then the other one, buffalo cauliflower, blue cheese, grilled red onion. We'll see how the non bread works out as a flatbread, and then I'm gonna grill my pizza dough. So we'll see how these doughs come out. Got it in. So far, we have bags all up in the way basil, blue cheese, burrata cheese, mild buffalo, red onion, cauliflower, mozzarella. Non bread. She got the roasted garlic non bread. I'm gonna grill my dough, so I just got a regular pizza dough. Arugula. Prosciutto. A peach. And a lemon. The grilled peach one with some balsamic glaze, too. It's gonna be fire. <laughs> Made it. So we spent fifty one twenty nine. Oh, what is that magic smell? <laughs> smells like cookies. Wow. Nah, it smells like sugar cookies. Fifty one bucks. We're feeding four people. You could definitely feed six to eight people with the amount of food we just bought. So if you're in college or something like that and you want to do a pizza night, flatbread night, you could easily divvy this up and probably everybody put in like five, ten bucks a piece and you can make some pizzas. You're on hand. So this is a good balling on a budget, college style kind of thing that you could do with all the people that you live with and split it and spend nothing and eat like a champion. All right, so here's the lineup on the pizza. If I have something spelled wrong, don't mind it. I'm such an awful speller, which I probably have one spelling mistake in there. One of the flatbreads is gonna be the buffalo cauliflower, grilled red onions, crumbled blue cheese, a lot of focus, and the mozzarella. And then the second one will be grilled peaches, burrata, lemon dressed arugula, basil, prosciutto, and then we'll finish it with the uh, balsamic glue. cauliflower flatbread this is season it and roast it and then buffalo it up throw it on the flatbread we got some good stuff
I'm thinking I'm gonna roast that cauliflower for about 10, 12 minutes. I feel like it's a little brown. And then we'll toss it with the buffalo, throw it on the flatbread, and then bake the flatbread with the cheese on it and all the other toppings. It's come up on. <laughs> take you guys outside with me to grill the dough and the peaches and the onions it's dark it's rainy I won't even pick up an autofocus at all you guys won't even be able to see what I'm doing so I'm gonna go outside I'm gonna grill all that stuff I'm gonna bring it back to you guys and I'm gonna show you what it looks like so that was about 12 minutes in the oven at 400 degrees and I'm just gonna keep the oven at 400 because when we come back up we're gonna put the pizzas in here I might even up it to like 450 but that's the color I'm looking for right there. Nice and golden brown. All roasted up with love. And here we have pizza number two. We made a little sauce base for this. Mix some blue cheese dressing with a little bit of buffalo, put that as the base. Same components, put together a little different. <laughs> peaches on this one. It's just red onion, burrata, garlic butter, prosciutto. Bur oh, I already said burrata. Uh. That's it on that one though. Alright, here we go. Five peaches, then Grab one peaches. of each. Peaches, burrata, oh. prosciutto, arugula, balsamic. We got one of the cauliflower. This is the one on the naan. Ca buffalo cauliflower. We got the burrata, garlic butter, arugula, prosciutto, balsamic. The classic cheese, because you can't go wrong. And then the other buffalo cauliflower that has the grilled red onion on that. We're on the one bite. Everybody knows the rules. We got the classic cheese. Can't go wrong with cheese. Mm -hmm. Just help them. Which one you get next? I ate my buffalo chicken one. I definitely shouldn't have done the buffalo. Blue cheese at the end. Buffalo cauliflower on the naan. Good. Definitely blue cheesy. Blue cheesy. The naan bread's good. Because it gives like crunch. 
-hmm. but it's still soft. Soft is good. I'll give you that. Now we got buffalo on the grilled pizza dough. I'm gonna give it to you on the buffalo one. More flavor? Mm-hmm. You need a base. Mm-hmm. I might have to go with that non one. Yeah. I think if you put, if I didn't chew the blue cheese on top, if you put either one, like just pick one blue cheese. It would be better. Yeah. But I think the sauce was key. Yeah. The sauce. Which one are you trying next? Yours. Oh. <laughs> all right this one is the the peach prosciutto arugula basil burrata a little bit of olive oil lemon mm -mm. no <laughs> this one's fire this one's good. With the peach, get the sweet. Mm -hmm. Prosciutto, you get the salty. We got the lemon, some acidity to balance out the creaminess from the burrata. And then that balsamic. Hold the paper towel for me real quick. All right, let's try. What'd you put on yours? Garlic butter. We got the garlic butter, burrata, prosciutto. What else is on yours? Balsamic. Is there onion on it? Yeah. Onion. Did you put blue cheese too? No. Okay, no blue cheese. Thank God. Oh man, fuck me! I got two of yours. <laughs> I'm gonna have to say my peach one over this one. You think? Mm -hmm. I think yours one on that one. Hers was the buffalo. Yeah. We might have a tie, people. I think we have a tie. I don't know, I haven't tried my own. She had the better buffalo pizza. Mm -hmm. I definitely, hands down, had the better burrata pizza, I think. I, I like peach, though. I like sweet. Oh. All in all. Good pizza night. The dessert pizza in full force. This thing looks so good. All right. The, puts me overboard. the grand finale pizza. The dessert pizza. <laughs> It's a 10 out of 10 pizza. <laughs> so now that I'm officially stuffed from all the flatbreads, I think we have a tie right here. The buffalo cauliflower pizza on the non bread. That was definitely the best out of the buffalo. I think that my burrata and peach one that got the most votes, that, that one out of the burrata pizzas. And then, I mean, honestly, the dessert one, the dessert one took the cake with the with the peanut butter and the bananas and the Oreos and the chocolate, that, that 10 out of 10, that was a good one right there. So now that I am stuffed, this is where I will end the video. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you throw that thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. I drop videos once a week. And most importantly, stay salty, people.